Hello, and welcome to the second installment of our series designed to help you implement Tatango. I'm Val Lapis, a senior solutions architect with Tatango, and I want to encourage you as you go through this series to ask questions, whether it's within our support team or in our community portal. And if any of the information found within this video is ambiguous or you feel it needs additional context, please let us know. In this video, we will address the various methods of integrating data into Tatango positives and negatives of each, and it'll help you choose how to deliver data to Tatango. This video assumes that you have watched the Tatango data model video, and future videos will dive great into greater depth with all of the method outside, outlined herein. The parts of this video is this introduction. Next, we will review the general method guidelines. Then we will move on to the types of data with methods of delivery as it relates to all data, accounts, then after that users, then usage, and then finally the collections.